Welcome to the ArcGIS product reviews. In today's spotlight is ArcGIS Indoors. It is a complete indoor mapping system for smart building management. You can create, curate, and share indoor maps and apps. Utility organizations can use ArcGIS Indoors to provide staff with apps to understand and manage the office or warehouse, to monitor indoor operations and conditions in near real time, and to enforce workplace safety with planning and design tools. We'll show you a few examples of how your utility can digitally transform your facilities. This web application shows us the details of the Esri Redlands campus layout. Let's take a closer look inside the main building queue. We can see information like seating locations and employee names for arrangements and turn on layers for safety, services, and event locations. We can view the same information on different floors of the building. Let's say this new employee needs to know how to get from his desk to the turtle pond to take a break. Popular places or employee names can be typed into the search bar and step-by-step -step directions are listed out so that he or she can get to their destination on campus. This can be useful to a utility when it comes to emergency routes, safe navigation through warehouses or lots, and even looking for a fellow employee. Moving on, we can use this Indoor Space Planner web application to view the same information inside Building Q and manage seating arrangements. A utility office is no different from this layout, but there are many ways to prioritize safety with our technology. This top row of private offices are vacant, so a manager can select the area and assign it to office hotel use. The map updates the symbology from gray to orange, showing a change in how the space is used. Then using a mobile device like this iPhone, employees can access the same map using the ArcGIS Indoors app. Now any employee can select an office, Designate a date and time for reservation and book it right inside the app. Using these tools to manage your indoor space can help utilities enable more employees, contractors, or vendors to enter your facility safely. Now that you can manage your space, you can also monitor indoor operations. This dashboard shows room occupancy in near real time based on sensors or trackers. These reports show current capacities and limits within the building. At building M, there are several high occupancy alerts. The darker room colors tell us we are over capacity in that space. This office cubicle currently holds six occupants, which is five occupants over the suggested capacity. These employees can be notified to disperse or find a room with a larger capacity for their meeting. Monitoring building capacities and compiling reports in a dashboard can make your work even in the field environment that much safer. Think about how you can use the same concept and apply it within smaller spaces, like this substation, for example. It's important to monitor the inside of who's entering the substation so that field engineers aren't piling into a facility and not following social distancing guidelines. Not only can sensors be used to track capacity, it can also be used to report the status of facility conditions. This next web application shows room unit temperatures based on a heat sensor. Throughout multiple floors of this large building, purple areas show colder than normal temperatures and pink areas show warmer than normal temperatures. For utilities, this can be used to monitor the inside of a communication server room, a gas compressor station, or an electric substation. If a temperature read falls below or above a certain threshold, your field crews can immediately be notified and respond to the situation. With this preview, we hope you empower your entire utility organization from the field to the office with your indoor spatial data. Got additional questions? reach out to the Esri Utility Team or ArcGIS Indoors Team for more information.